When you're making a game like Call of Duty Black Ops 2, you're trying to pull together the greatest talents you can in the world. People talk about this connection in Hollywood with games. The greatest thing about that for us is that tremendous talent, and they're interested in working in this medium with us, and in particular, on Black Ops. Having the opportunity to work with a Hollywood writer who's worked on movies like The Dark Knight, created the most compelling villains in cinema history. To me, that's amazing. We were approaching it in some ways as a big event movie. Even though it's a first-person shooter, it's got to be sophisticated, it's got to be funny, it's got to be challenging, it's got to have twists and turns. In the case of Black Ops, I would argue that the story is better than most movies that are being made. I'm watching the Oscars last year, and I see Trent Reznor win the Academy Award. A year later, I see him walking around Treyarch, and I think to myself, am I dreaming? Trent Reznor is creating the score for our video game. I look at video games as, as, a, as a true art form. The chance to be involved in something like this is exciting to me. You know, I feel it's every bit as um, viable as film work or music or anything else. When you start the game, you're going to hear Trent Reznor's music. It'll automatically immerse you in our world. Increasingly, the line between you know, an event movie and an event video game are starting to blur, which is a good thing. I've started to see blockbuster movies rip off sequences from video games as opposed to the other way around. The games have gotten more intense and more realistic and more engrossing and deeper. Video game culture has expanded into you know, the largest form of entertainment. People love to be told stories, but I think what's so unique about our medium is we get the opportunity to experience and live in the world where the stories are being told. You can't watch a movie in a movie theater and change the fate of the main character, but well, you can do that in a video game. Pre-order now and get the Nuketown 2025 bonus map.